great. Okay, welcome back to Boss Boss Games. I am your host, Boss. All right. So, as we left off on, man, guess who finally came back? Alan Wake. He finally came back after that crazy boss battle that we had and stuff with the uh, McGrader, not Grader, whatever his name is and stuff. Guess who popped back up? Alan Wake, man. And it's funny because it's been 13 years. So apparently, the game came out in 2010. I thought it came out in 2011. Not bad, bro. I played only the remastered version just last year and stuff. But yeah, Alan Wake have finally returned, man. So I wonder if he's going to try to get in contact with uh, Alice and then his homeboy and his manager. So I don't know, man. Well, we just got to see. But anyway, guys, I hope your day's going pretty good. Please like and subscribe to the channel. That will really help me out a lot. Please comment down below. Let me know what other games I should play. Also, follow me on my other platform from TikTok, Twitch, Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, Rumble. You name it. All right, let's get started. I'm a little bit scared, bro, because I got the light off. <laughs> let's do this. So we need to investigate the previous fire area. Am I still... Is this the dark place? No, it can't be. I got out. Great, because he... The P.I. from your books has the same name as me. Great. Moving on. So, it's check the... bit of a hike to the car, Wake. Get your bearings, then we'll head out. I just... I, I need another minute. Cauldron Lake. I thought I'd never see this place again. Take your time. But you should know these woods aren't the safest. Yeah. Uh, it's getting dark. You have a flashlight? It's not safe without a light. I have a light. And a gun. You can relax, Wake. And pages. If you see pages of writing anywhere, you must take them and keep them safe. Our lives could depend on it. They have vital information. We know about the pages, Wake. We'll keep an eye out for them. Okay. All right. Okay, just give me a moment. It's okay. Uh. Take your time. Should look around. With the flooding gone, could be further clues out there. All right. The Let me see. Painkillers. What is this one? Oh, for benches and stuff. I think I'm gonna put the. Oh, so I think what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna actually put this in quick slot. This. Let me see. Hold up. Okay, there you go. I'm out of shotgun shells, which sucks. But um. Oh, can't go that way. Said have a look around and stuff. So let me check the map. Where are we at? Oh, we're here. Okay, so well, we could. It said look for the flooding. There's painkillers right there and stuff. You can actually go that way real quick. Um, I wonder if we could go up here. It said take a look around. Nope, can't get up there. So it said. Let me see. It said investigate the previous flood area. Okay, so I guess we go back around. All right. I'm taking a look around just to make sure I ain't forgetting anything. All right, we're good. Let's go. We're going to go back to the flood area. So, as I could gather from the information, I guess he said that he never, he thought he would never get out. You know, Thomas is gone. So, the dude that he was helping us in the last game. Let me check the map. Okay, we gotta go all the way around. I have a flash light, but the I can't tell if it's like hold up. I guess we could go through here and check it out real quick. Yeah. Alright, let's check out this area real quick. A locked box. Always a locked box. Is that the cult of the tree symbol on it? Woo! Okay, so we need to figure out uh i don't know okay so it'll mess up if you don't get the right one okay so you could try any code you want oh look at that 
Okay, so it's this one, this one, this one. See? Notes and ammo. Looks like they're tools of the trade. Why would we have that extinguisher? Oh, another one. So we get we'll open it up. And what is this? A flare? Is this a is this a flare? So okay, we got shotgun ammo. Let me see. Okay, we got shotgun ammo, and then we got one hair. So uh, let's put this on too. Hold up, I messed it. I'm messing up. Put this on a quick slot too. It should be right here. Flare, painkillers. Probably put this right up here, and then battery. I think we're cool on that. Okay, so apparently we can't go anywhere else and stuff. Okay. So we check that out. Yeah, I need some bullets. I gotta make sure we we have bullets that will last. I'm gonna check the map. I always gotta check the map every second. Okay, it seems like this area right here. Oop. Okay, it seems like this area right here is blocked off. So what the heck overlaps? Okay. And like that area is blocked off for some reason though. Now I'm gonna go investigate the pool. What's this? Manuscript. Apparently. Hold up. Apparently, there have been some manuscripts that I didn't look at. Which one? Is it this one? A dark place? He's been on the trail of the writer forever. The writer who despised Hemingway, Bukowski, Wake. I'll get you. I'll find you. I'll make you pay. You're in over your head. He descended into the tunnels from the dark city into the ocean of darkness. Next stop, Caldera Street Station. Something, a presence, rumbled. Not a train. Shadows shifted on the platform. The writer's cult waited for him there. The cult of the word. A cultist leaned close. I carry his words close to my chest now. You're not allowed in the lake until he says otherwise. He'd be caught. Murdered. They got him. They didn't get him. He was reborn out of hate. He was there, but he was risen. Sent to find the light switch up from the lake that was not the lake. Hmm. Okay, well, hey. Uh, let me see. Anything on the radio? Okay. Television, so the same? Okay. Let's get out of here. Oh. Thank you. Oh, this batteries. That's it. Okay, hopefully nothing jump out on us. Quick turn, you could... What, what is that? What the hell is quick... Okay. Say investigate the... Oh! Okay, I shot at it. Yeah, I did. Oh! Oh, golly. Turn up. What the heck? Dude. Dude, this wolf is tough. Even the animals are turning into monsters. Oof. Oh man. Oh. 
the okay oh okay wow that's interesting all right i got the painkillers um let's get the hell out of here I only got six bullets left. Where are we going? I guess we'll take a shortcut, I guess. We ain't nothing up here. Yeah, it's getting dark real quick, too. Wasn't it already dark? like one of those moments when you like what the hell's going on try to see can we go this way no we're blocked but we gotta go on the other side Take the shotgun out, might as well. Oh, oh my God. Jesus, where you at? Dude, this dude, this dog is moving. I mean, this wolf is moving hella fast. Okay, I think I got him. Uh, let's see, hold up. I gotta check the map sometimes because I don't know where to go. Wait, is this blocked off? I'm just looking to see. All right, no, it's not. Shouldn't be. Man, I don't got no battery. Like, do I? Yeah, I'm out of my battery. Sun's out though, but for some reason they're still attacking us. Almost to the car. To Brightfield. Mr. Wake, we're taking you back to our field office in Bright Falls. You can freshen up there, and then we'll talk properly. Hey, Mom. Before you say anything, I'm totally fine. Don't freak out. Dad shouldn't have even texted you. Logan? No one texted me. What's going on? I'm totally fine. I slipped. That's all. God, it's not the end of the world. Put your father on the phone. Um, okay. Dad, it's Mom. Don't worry, hun. Logan slipped in the shower and bumped her head. She has a slight concussion, but I'm keeping an eye on her. Lucky I heard her fall. She could have drowned. Jesus, David. Why didn't you call? I tried. It didn't go through. She's fine, really. But what about you? You sound stressed. No, it's a... Uh, just a weird case, that's all. Well, if you need a hint, my years of board game victories tell me Colonel Mustard did it. 
<laughs> I'll, I'll keep an eye out for him. <laughs> Love you, Dave. Love you too, honey. Wanna say bye to Logan? Just tell her I love her. Bye for now. Is there anyone you'd like us to reach out to, Mr. Wake? You've been gone a long time. No. No. If they'd be in danger, it'll come for me. Okay, let's talk about something else. Robert Nightingale. Do you know him? You were both here in 2010. The Dark Presence got him back then. That's the last time I saw him. Thirteen years. Tell us about the pages. You had what looks like a title page with you. Return. Is this the name of the story on these pages? The writer's name has been scratched out pretty violently, but your name can still be made out underneath. <laughs> scratched out. Yeah, scratch. Did you write these pages, Mr. Wake? I'm trying to remember. It's, it's, it's a crazy jumble, like a, like a nightmare. It doesn't, it doesn't make sense. Eight night. Oh, fuck. Was I in a talk show tonight? Waking up in places with no memory of how I'd gotten there. It was out of control. I didn't need another mugshot in the fucking tabloids. Dude, we're back. Was that a recording? Wait, hold up. Look around real quick, make sure. Yeah, something's. Something I miss. But let's do this real quick. Hang on real quick. Let me uh let's go and change this real quick. I'm gonna go back to quality. Don't want the game lagging or anything. I felt a strange pull to the team. Whoa. Good to see you, Alan. Uh, this must be an exciting time for you. Tell me, does it ever get old? Sorry, does what get old? Publishing a new book. Are you okay there, my friend? You look like you've been cooped up in the writer's room for a few too many years. This is exactly how I feel. 
<laughs> you know, I've waited so long to get my hands on the sequel to Departure. You left us on quite the cliffhanger. We've all been dying to know what it's not a lake, it's an ocean really means. You and me both. Well, our wait is over. Your new book, Initiation, hits the shelves tomorrow. What? That's exactly what every reader will be asking. This book is mind-bending. It's so cerebral. I mean, how would you describe it? A, a, an auto-fictional thought experiment? A, a, a horror story? A postmodern detective story? Wait. This isn't right. I, I haven't written anything. He's so humble. Okay. You got me. Good prank. Very funny. But yeah, I uh, sad to say, I, uh, I've not written this. I, I'd remember if I'd written a book, right? Or maybe it was written by your evil double. <laughs> ah, well played, man. That is spot on. Playing the role here. Pretending the world of the book overlaps our own. Very meta indeed. You see, Initiation tells the story of a fictional writer named Alan Wake who is trapped in a nightmare, desperately trying to find the manuscript of a novel he has forgotten he has written. The book is set in New York, but it might not be New York at all. He is tormented by his dark doppelganger, guided by visions of a fictional detective he has written. That's right, Alex Casey is in this book as well. Uh, I guess we'll just keep doing this the whole show. The joke's on me. Isn't that what you sign up for with autofiction? No, but seriously, I found the, the structure of the reality you build in the book fascinating. It reminded me of The Matrix. I mean, the writer is physically in his writer's room, trapped there, and he projects himself out to this dark dream of New York through the story he is writing. Uh, like astral projection. Did I get that right? Yeah. That's exactly right. Go on. I should be taking notes here. This is great stuff. Note to that other Alan Wake in that room writing this as we speak. Are we all in your story, Alan? <laughs> no, I, I, I wish you every success with your new book, Alan. I hope it's as successful as your best-selling Alex Casey series. Initiation hits the shelves tomorrow. After this, I'm sure we'll all be eagerly awaiting the culmination of this hero's journey trilogy of yours. A book called Return, perhaps. <laughs> Man, thank you for one of the strangest interviews of my entire career, Alan. <laughs> all this talk of meta narratives. I have to expect them to disappear once this scene ends. <laughs> Dude, that was incredible. Hello? I'm losing it. Something's not right here. I needed to get home to Alice. You know what's funny? Like, in the, in the DLC, he did have an evil go uh, devil gamer that turned mad and evil. So, let's see what we could do. Ain't got no flashlight, though. That's crazy. Hey, this dude, the... the hell was that interview? Some kind of joke? Initiation? I never wrote a book called Initiation. This felt like a bad dream. Could make a good horror story. Oh. We could actually look around and stuff. Uh, I'd rather not to. But it's funny. The dude, the... I guess the talk show host. I think I remember him from Supergirl. He was playing Martian Manhunter. Just shut the door. Lock, of course. In between with Mr. Door. Oh, that opened. Hey! Oh. I think I've been locked in. Anybody? Fuck. Now I have to find the code myself. 
Yep. Uh, well, let's go in here, then. I was a mess. I'd never heard of this talk show or Mr. Door before. None of it felt right. Was I losing my mind? A little bit. Yes. Yeah, I don't see any codes. So, all right. I guess we gotta just look around. Oh, say, oh God, of Asgard. Huh. Oh gods of Asgard. That name sounded familiar. Yeah, it does. Hey, I don't see anything though. Thing, I don't see anything. Oh wait, six six five. That could be the code. I think that was the wasn't that the two old geezer? There was something here. A broken transmission I couldn't quite make out. Alright, let's check it out. What was that? A message? Oh, impossible to say. Spooky as a mother. Doesn't really hear. Yeah. All right, let's keep going. Lock? Huh. It's funny as heck. Okay. That's lock. Oh. It's another room. There was something in the studio with me. I had to get out. For real. You need to get out. surfaced about riding here for countless days okay so no goes okay what is this a plot board for mapping out a story on the index cards the nightmare that just happened to me a summary of the story so far but other notes as well warnings I had written them. I couldn't remember what it all meant. The name Scratch filled me with dread. I could trust these words. I had to act on them. You must write to escape. Plot the story? Why there's a television right in the middle? Oh, it's locked. I would have left. I ain't gonna hold you. I would have jumped out that window. Let me see. Trap. Beware. Alice. I have no. to write more. So, I wonder if Barry is gonna come back too. Could manifest as reality in this dark place. 
I'd use my writing to project myself out of this room. Like a deep sea diver to go deeper and explore the depths of this prison for a way out. This room was my boat. Writing was my lifeline. I would start again at the talk show. Yo, I just remember. I just remember. They're a band. Oh yeah, the old oh the oh the uh what's it called? The old gods to Asgard. They're from the other game when it was uh um old people. Nope, I tried. <laughs> I literally was trying to escape. Alright, let's do this. Welcome back to the show. So, Alan, as the uh, creator of the character, how do you feel about this? Sorry, what? I, I know it can be an awkward question with the man sitting right next to you, but I mean, how do you feel about him in the role of Casey? Does he look the part to you? Uh... <laughs> he looks exactly like I always imagined Casey to be. It's uncanny. Thank you. That means so much to me. I'm a huge fan of your books. So, uh, what's the problem, Alan? Because on more than one occasion, you voiced your reservations about the adaptations. Uh, it's not that. They're their own thing. They've gone with choices that are different from mine. I, I, I feel protective about my stories, and these adaptations... I don't know. I, I guess I just wish I could have been more involved in making them. Well, in that case, you won't have seen this either. We have a clip from the new film, Murder Case Case. Should we roll it, or do you want to say something first, Sam? Nah, just roll it. <laughs> this city was an old scar that refused to heal. The rain made it fester. It needed the sun, but there was only the night. I was tired. Insomnia covered me like a plastic film. I was watching the world through a rain-slick window, my own reflection haunting the view. I was trying to track down a missing writer. My only clue was a table lamp, shaped like an angel. The only thing to shed light on this sordid mystery. Great. Murder case, Casey. Great job, Sam. Very exciting and very meta. I'm looking forward to seeing more. Wait, stop. What was that about a writer? About a lamp? <gasps> oh, godly, back in the studio again. Got too close to the truth. Hopefully, these. Okay, I hope I hope the guy these uh objects don't come at us. Wait, I can't okay, I'm about to say I can't even move. Alright, let's do this again, shall we? Pretty sure it's the same stuff. Oh. So it's not this one this time. Alright, I guess let's go in. Oof, God, leave, bro. Why you gotta do it like that? Go now. 665. Okay, I messed up. I said uh, something else. Hmm. 
Tac. Okay, something is it's a different code. It gotta be. Is it the same book or different book? Same book. Okay. Now we gotta figure out this code again. Oh, so it's five, six, five, five, six, five. They changed the code. Crazy. Five, six. Let me, uh, yeah, there we go. A little bit easier. Hello? Same place. Just open the door. Anybody here? Dude, I couldn't do this. I'm sorry. This remind me of the first scene of the, the first one. Where we go to the restroom and stuff. Oh Jesus. Ah, no raid. There you are, Tom. Oh, not so much evil that not a bit of good as well. Not one without the other. <laughs> good to see you. Hey, I, I can't seem to find my way out of here. Can you point me to the exit? Not <laughs> the hell of it is. Of course, Tom. The work will instruct its maker. I was gonna get something from the basement for you, but you can get it yourself now. Uh, the more cooks, the worse the soup. <laughs> uh, what's in the basement? Get from the basement? And my name's Alan, not Tom. Yeah, yeah, but the cut up a man's a man, but the man with the tool makes two, Tom. Egani. <laughs> And a man with a tool can build his own exit. It's in a shoebox in the basement where you left it. <laughs> Safe as in the Lord's purse. Here's the key. Sorry, have we met before? Have we met before? Are you trapped in the dark place too? You remember Ahti, the janitor. You can't be lost if you don't worry about where you are headed. So, don't worry, Tom. The sun will shine even into a heap of twigs. Just remember to turn on the lights. It won't take long when you get to work. I've been trying to find a way to escape the dark place. Any suggestions? He who mouths about his troubles is the prisoner of his troubles. It's not easy to get out. But don't you worry, Tom. The home is still there where the heart is. I often think about it when I mop the floor and look into the puddle. Water is the memory of the world. Water finds its way. The janitor was a bit out there, but still a friendly face. I had to trust the basement would get me out of here. Wait, here's the map. Cool. Now we got a map. Okay, we gotta go to the basement. Let's zoom in a little bit. Yeah, let's zoom in a little bit. So there's the backstage. Where is the basement? The band room. 
It looks as though the basement's right here. Oh, okay, so we go zoom, go out, hit here, and then I think we gotta take the Oh, we gotta take the laundry and then it'll take us to the basement and then out the exit way. Alright. Wait. Whoa. Wait. There we go. Oh was... Okay. Okay. So we go this way. Can't see anything. Ain't got no flashlight. So I think right now he had a uh, point in his life when he wanted to escape. Heck? Over there, there's the exit sign. Trying to walk a little slow so I don't run into trouble. Thing over here. Can't see crap. Someone been eating here. There we go. I have been a shoebox. Was this what the janitor had left for me? The lamp felt significant. A tool for bringing light to the darkness. I felt a magnetic pull between the lamp and the light overhead. Whoa! When the light jumped into my lamp, the whole room changed, like something in a dream. Opening a way forward, the lamp was humming, the bulb glowed, it held the light now. Ah! Oh! Okay, I see what it does now. Just looking around, make sure I ain't forget nothing. Guess we ain't having no gun, I guess, but alright. Give me that. All right. This looks like something outside of hill. Okay. I felt another surge from the lamp. I could use it again. On the way out of here. The glow there we go. Went out, shifting the light in the room. The light carved out something new from the darkness. Okay, here we go. Okay. Just looking around. Right. We're good now. Every time he runs, he just opens the door like that. That's hilarious. Where we at right now? Here's the exit again. Oof. Hold up. Or even go that way. There's a stairs. There's like multiple ways to go. Let me see. Hold up. So it's a. Wait. It's a sh first floor shortcut. Okay. So we got to go this way. Where is this one up here? Let me see. Oh, 
Ah, uh, you will go back to the generator room. I needed to find another way out. Okay, I got you. That's why I, I'm, I want to look around just so I can make sure I ain't forgetting anything. All right, this is the way to go. Let's keep going. Okay. Oh, super dark right now. to drown me i'm losing myself i have to fight it i have to remember the clicker the light switch i lost it but i have the lamp now the lamp the switch was cut from this place is a nightmare not real and yet more real than anything the danger and the horror are real it feeds off my mind twisting whatever it takes into psychotic reality i'm trapped here I write to escape. I've tried this many times, written countless stories, forgotten how many. I keep failing, but I must keep trying. I use the story to dive deeper. Every word I write is a step forward on this spiral of the darkness. I dive to the body to find the answer, the, the map, and the key, and the compass. It's combined to form a door leading out. But how do you open a door that's not a door? Bottom of an ocean, that's not an ocean, and a lake, and a lake. Some say that it leaves forever to float, but I lose you on every time. Some say that it leaves forever to float. I can see you there, but you don't see me anywhere. I'm right in front of you, I'm right here on this one ending world. What are you looking at? Is it your face on a pane of glass? Cause somehow this window becomes a trap on this winding road will it ever let me go forever i am fading to black forever i am circling back just to fall into this trap this Okay, well. Oh, okay. Apparently I got the light, but I think we have to do this so we can see if there's a way out of here. Oh, no, it's not. Oh, wait, hold up. Oh, okay. Quick save. There we go. Oof, all right. Oh, there we go. Here's a way out. Whoa. The payphone was ringing. Somehow I knew the call was for me. What is this? Hello? Hello, Wake? Yes. Do you know who I am? No. Who is this? We'll get to that later. There are spies all over. Shadows. A sense of deja vu washed over me. Had I had this conversation before? Alan, listen to me carefully. Caldera Street Station, the subway. You need to go there. I'll call you again later. Make sure to pick up. Do I know you? I, I know you from somewhere. You've just forgotten again. We're in this together. Don't worry. I got it now. We've been working. Great. I I'm losing you. Hello? 
I think this is New York. They said it could be New York City, it could be anyway, Cassidy. Give me the map. Okay. The Let me check the map now. Caldera Street Station. I had to go there. Okay. So that's the talk show. Where where is it at? That's Wheeler Street. Oh, Barry Wheeler. So we gotta go right here. Here it is. So, as much as I want to explore, I don't trust any of this crap. <laughs> so, I think, is we going the right way? Yes, we are. Okay. Fuck. Okay. Oh. Don't mind me, just passing through. Shadows stirred like there was someone there, but there was no one. I wanted to keep it that way. Yeah, and that's why I'm walking. Hold up. We gotta go this way, actually. The Caldera Street station sign was there, but the entrance was missing. I had to make it appear. Maybe I could use the lamp to reveal the station entrance. The lamp was dead in my hand. I needed to find a light for it. Uh... Over here? Oh, this is creepy as hell. Right here? Like, oh my Jesus, yeah! Let me, uh, let me get out of here. <laughs> I don't know how we supposed to find a light. I see one over there, but I don't know. I see no, yeah, that's why I don't want to explore because I'm scared of the mother. I see a light over there. There was a light at the end of the alley ahead. Cold day in hell. That remind me of Die hard for some reason. Oh, Jesus. Keep going. Let's keep swimming. Is this the way it was on the page? What the hell? Oh, hey. We met at Door Show. Alan Wake, the writer. I'm Alex Casey, looking into a murder. Come on, what? What is this? There's a piece of evidence, a manuscript of a novel. You wouldn't know anything about it? A manuscript? What manuscript? I need to see it. Rumor had it the manuscript contained the details of the murders. A murder cult was following the story to commit their gruesome acts. Was Wake their leader? Had he written it? How far would he go to create a perfect work of art? Or would he be the next victim? Now we're walking right into it. That's that's fantastic. Damn it. He gone. There he is. This alley in a dream I had. He was just gonna keep killing me here. Loop by loop. You're not gonna get what you want. You think you know. You 
no shit. You don't really want to know. You're gonna get what's coming to you. This was an echo of the books I had written for years. Picking up Casey's gun felt like I was assuming the role of the detective. I had a light now. I needed to get back to the subway station entrance. What? I'm hella confused. Tell me to go this way. Wait, hold up. Why is it telling me to go this way? It said, aim your flashlight at the sparrow. A phrase repeated over and over. The words resonated with meaning. Had I written this? What does that mean? Let's see, words of power could be used to make weight stronger. You could assign them in the writer room. Master now held restored myself when new words was covered, I guess. Oh, okay. So world gun, world war. But you could use any of that. World stuff, world action, increase any delve. Okay, this is a RBG then. Oh, wow. I did not know that. Okay. Then take it back. Okay. Oh, hey, I didn't know. No, I did not know that. Oh, oh. Stop, stop, man. You waste your battery doing that. Stop. Damn. Oh, my. Oh. Oh. Dude, this is annoying. I could fight back. I could use the light to open the subway entrance now. Do I got to start dodging? There's nothing else I could do. Okay. So this is a little bit like a RPG. Level up your character and everything and stuff. It wasn't in the last game, to be honest. I need to find another light to go deeper inside. I'm up. I'm actually going to use this right now. Might as well use this. Oop, messed up. I get used to the control. 
see if there's anything else I can. Oh. And uh, use that for. Uh, let's see. I got three batteries. All right, apparently we gotta go all the way back out. Cause gotta find more light, shall we? There's a light over there. Oh, ooh, ooh, ooh! Stop! Ah, sucks. Oh. There's a light over here. I needed to find a way around that fence. Nope. Okay. See that. Not close to it, uh. Yeah, I don't think I'm close to it. To get that, that's a door. All right, let's just see how we do. What's this area anyway? I don't think we could go this way. I'm trying to see if there's nothing we could do. Oh my god. Okay. Oh wait. There's the heck? Uh, I'm aiming it. Flashlight. Can I not get it? What the heck? Wait, hold up. How do you do the... Uh, I'm, f I'm flashing it. And get on this car? I, I can't get it. Why can't I get it? What the heck? I'm super confused. I think you do you have to have the the lamp light to do this? Let me see something real quick cuz I'm I'm totally confused. Okay, let me see something. Maybe if I have the lamp thing, maybe it will work. Oh, snap! God, Lee. You don't mess up with me, bro. Okay, let me see something. Okay. Yeah, you have to have the lamp. In order to get it. Yeah. I think we already got it. Let me see. Okay. So you have to have that. Increase the damage. Hmm. 
gonna do this. Okay, so you have to have the lamp thing in order for you to do this. That's that's how it goes. If you don't have it, then you're not gonna be able to do it. Oh, I don't know how we're supposed to get over this. Okay. Better mess out me. All right, let's see. There we go. So up gun. Okay. I gotta stop being scared. We're gonna. We're just gonna do this. Flare gun. Increase knockback force. Uh, shotgun. Uh, chance not to. Uh, I'll take this. Why not? Okay, you can put the lamp right here. There we go. There we go. The uh, thing is... Oh, okay, there we go. I'm almost out of bullets, though. Oh, I'm super scary, yo. I'm not gonna hold you. Okay, so that's how you get over there. I can't get up there. Ah, uh, so that's how you get up here. I don't know if you could get over here. I need to grab that real quick, but... Oh, there's a ladder. I need, I need batteries. I need all that. Thank you. Me battery. And killers that I'll take that. Look around, make sure I ain't forgetting anything. It's like, what kind of place is this, bro? Wait, what? Scared the mother. Oh, snap. Okay. <laughs> Apparently, you can open this. <laughs> Kind of scared. Echo. The hell is an echo? Do we? Oh, we don't have battery. Oh, wow. Wait, wait, wait. I thought there was a battery in there. We didn't grab it. Oh! Oh! Oh my freaking god, dude. Oh my god. You know what? Keep the battery. I don't care. This. <coughs> oh, oh! Okay, I'm out. I'm out. I ain't got nothing. Oh, oh, oh! Oh, stop, dude. Right here. Oh. Oh my god. Oh god. Wait. Shadow box could be for items you put in there. What the heck? That's not what I need. I need battery. Shoot. Keep the battery. Shoot. I don't care. I think they keep coming back. I don't. I just don't know. I don't know what they do to you if you let them touch you. Do I ain't gonna hold you it's so hard to freaking hum me? What's this? Over here. Jeez. 
Jesus! Maybe they won't mess with me. Oh, I need a light. I need another light. Okay, I'll come back for that. Wake my ass. I'm good. All right, uh, this is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna, I'm gonna just come back to this area and stuff. I don't know if they come at them. I'm out. I'm out. Okay, so uh, I'm gonna just make a break to the the thing, and then I'm gonna go back to there and do the go do the humming thing. I I just need to go get the light real quick. So, yep. Bye. See you later. What you gonna do? What's up? What's up? Oh. There's the battery. Oh man, I'm so scared every freaking time, dude. Okay. Well, I'm up here so I could be able to... The heck was that? Nope, nope. Turn it off. A line? A line the echo by approaching it in the right angle? What the heck? What did that mean? Right angle? I don't know what that means. Right angle. What, what does that mean? Wait, what? Right angle. Like, like, like this? That's. I don't know what that means. Align the echo by approaching it at the right angle? Specific angle? What does that mean? Do like like this? I had written books about Alex Casey for years. Something lingered here. A line from a half forgotten story. I don't know what that means. What what were we supposed to do? No, turn off, turn off. I literally do not know what that means. Oh, wait. There we go. Tried to wash away the sins of this city. <laughs> but some sins, the evidence of the crimes committed, could never be erased. Not by the rain, or any amount of therapy from Dr. Jack Daniels. It remained bruises under my skin, like tattoos. Bruises in my soul. Scar tissue on my heart. The rain never stopped falling. And I never stopped drinking. I don't know what that means, but uh, I feel him. Okay, so we came up here for nothing. I really want to get across there because the light's over there. So, all right, we're going to start running again. We're going to go back the other way and then just start running. Oh, go down. All right. Run, just run. Yeah, whatever, whatever. I'm just gonna just make a run for it. Huh. I get quick saves and stuff. Wait, hold up. Oh, what the? Wait, can we? Okay, we can't steal this light. <laughs> I thought we could just steal this light. Okay, so there's this up here humming. I don't know what's going on. Hello. Oh. Whoa. Hey, you snuck up on me. Sorry. Have we met? Memory problems again, huh? Yeah, we've met. Tim Breaker. We've shared notes. Hey, I've made some progress on the map. If you want to take a look. Still haven't found my mystery man though. Uh You're making a map. Trying to. It's hard to map a dream though. I keep ending up in unexpected places. 
I find interesting things like those strange markings that react to the light, but never the one thing that I'm looking for. Feel free to check the map out. Oh, I've been stockpiling supplies while I poke around. If you find a stash, take anything you need. I appreciate the help. Who's this mystery man? Oh, it wouldn't be much of a mystery if I knew. All I have is a name. Warlandor. A talk show host? No. No, that doesn't sound like him. The guy has many disguises, but a talk show host? No. I'll keep looking. Whoa. This is a mine. I guess this is where he went. Okay, hold it. Let me uh, take some of your supplies, homie. Uh, but, wow. I didn't expect you to be here. I'm gonna be honest with you. Okay, we got the dark place map, and... <laughs> well, that's my crazy wall. I'm just trying to make sense of things. Don't judge He's... me. I'll trade you walls any day. See, I was at the morgue. I was about to give evidence to the FBI. They were transforming me here to the dream reality. Why? Oh, man. Wow. Who, where, why, motive, why me? Yeah, he's been abducted. So, missing time, no memory till now. I always end up here where I forgot. Forget what I get out. Abduction, alien, door, UFO, problem, John. I don't know what that means, but dream. Me, but not me. Other, I know, yet they are different. The red headed woman? Red headed woman. You know what that means? Okay, so we got. Now we got a map to the dark place. Okay. So there's the break room. There's a point of instance that said. What is this? Huh. We did an alley already. I guess we gotta go to the talk show soon. We'll put the light over here. I already got this one already. Oh, there's an echo over here too. This game, bro. I thought it would be fast and stuff, but guess not. See you around, Alan. Nah, come with me. <laughs> okay. It's gonna just move through everybody. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna try this. I'm just gonna move through. Okay, there's a ladder up here, but let me see what's over here. Wait, where are we at? Okay, we're, we're getting there. Okay, okay. Let me let me use the ladder real quick. Whatever, homie. Freaking out of here. I just want to check around. They force you to explore this game. Really do. You don't want to, but it forces you to. I know pig killer. Okay. Yeah, it really does force you to explore this game and stuff. Yeah, screw you. I'm out. Come on, open the door. It's crazy this game is. I think this is it right here. This character and mother do. What would be up here? Yeah, we finally got to the other side. I'm kind of shocked. <laughs> uh, what the heck was that? Be over here. Why would this be here? Huh. 
I think once we grab the there it is right there. Oh look at that. I didn't need to do that. Why did it okay this is weird. So I didn't really need the light. So that was by accident. Freaking scared out of my mind, bro. And I'm playing in the dark. That's the thing. I don't I always be like, oh yeah, it's just a game. It's just a game. But at the same time, you be scared out of your mind. But I don't play a lot of horror games and stuff. So how did we end up here again? I'm just trying to know my route. <laughs> Oh, right here. Okay. That's how we ended up here. Another one. Okay, we got another one. There we go. Now we could go back the other way. Just preparing. I'm mentally preparing myself, y'all. What I was going to do, I was going to go back up there. Make sure I didn't forget that. All right, here we go. No, only. Where? Did I change? Oh. Okay. I thought, oh, good thing I came back. <sighs> All right, I'm out of here. If I gotta pause the game, I apologize. <sighs> Say it's favorite. Alright. We finally got the light from that side. Oh. You know what I gotta do? I gotta go back. I forgot one more symbol. I forgot one more symbol I was supposed to go look at. Don't run through everybody. Yo, yeah, whatever, bro. I'm out of here. I'm not gonna waste my lights on you guys anymore. Unless y'all really coming after me. Nope. Alright, Chris save. No, I'm gonna just go back to where I was. Nope, I'm out of here. Okay, so how you get the symbol? Did we get this already? Oh wait, now I'm about to get it. There we go. It's kind of weird. I guess you don't do anything. I don't know, bro. Is it increase damage. Uh, see, so increase damage dealt by the last bullet in the world. Uh, we could do that. Restore 15 health. Will you do that? And then increase. We do this one. And then uh, the lamp. Let's, let me see. When using a flashlight boost. And then. Oh, excuse me. Okay, let's go back. All right, guys. It's been a roller coaster of a game right now. All right, I'm gonna end the video right here, guys. 
So guys, I want to thank you guys for watching. Like and subscribe to the channel. Comment down below. Let me know what other games I should play. Also, follow me on my other platform from TikTok, Twitch, Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, Rumble. You name it. Till next time I'm out. We continue.